And here we go again. Last time I did some off-screen grinding. Off-screen grinding of the casino variety. Because no one wants to watch someone play slots all day. Not that I did any actual slots, because for one, they suck. And uh, for two, that one person who said that the logic puzzle was low risk, low reward. Well, maybe if you're only going for like, I don't know, two hits and out. If you actually play the game. Turns out each one of these uh, little things that you get, the two, the three, those are multipliers. So you got the uh, zero earned coins right here. You get a two, gets two. Fairly simple. Get a one, that's a multiplier. One times two, still two. Might as well mark those. You kind of just add up uh, what is expected and you've got how much is going to be in that particular row. So that's a seven and one, three. Plus two equal is a uh, three more than five, which would be if all of these was one. You get the five number and one explosive, so there's one, two in this row. There you go. Whoop, nope. And then board clears. You got the uh, multiple multiples. As you might notice, that is 15,000 coins. Um, yeah. I don't think it counts as having a problem if you just win. Each level of the board you clear, you're going to get more of these little things to find, so you're going to have higher multiples. When you get to level 6, you're getting like 300 per board clear. And that's about equivalent to... what was it? Right, um... The slots, you get three sevens, that's 300. And... That slot machine game actually requires, you know, ability to play well. So, let's see. 5 plus 1, 6. So, that row's done. One of these is 2. Done. This has 8 total. Total of 6 found so far. And there's the rest of the 8. Done. Easy as pie. I don't know why I'm still doing this, considering I've already explained pretty much everything there is to this that one. And I've got enough to get the two rare Pokemon. There we go. Now I'm out. If you fail on one of these guys, you get shunted back a few levels. So, yeah, I'm out. Now to go buy some actual Pokemon. I don't know what this is, so... No, I don't know what it is, so whatever. And give me that bear end. I don't know what it is. Oh, right, it's the little dragon snake thing. Let's see what kind of levels those things got. Probably five. Like getting these things from an egg. I did confirm that 31 is the level that your Pokemon can get to and then immediately stop obeying you if they're uh, traded like, you know, my one high level Pokemon is. 
31! Woo! Withdraw. What is a tecton? Okay. Uh, Baron was around here somewhere. Alright, so. Tracton. So, Dragon Steel. I'm gonna take that out. Level 26, not too bad. So, pause it. What else do I have? Um, that one's got the XP share, so I'll deposit barrel for a bit. And take out that dragon snake. Or, well, just plain dragon, I guess. Out. Time for arranging. Ah, dang. Level 30, level 30. This is gonna suck in like one level. Ew. Item, take. Item, give. Because my starter has not been getting any showtime. It's being outshone by literally things picked up off the street. It's a beach. Entirely water Pokemon based. And hey, Grass Water is fairly decent defensive typing here, even if it is, you know, extremely sucky in terms of everything else. I don't care! I already fought and lost against you once! Finally! Callie. Ugh. Tubjaw, so fighting type. Swap you out for the sheep. Ah, no, not Pursuit. Survives with 2 HP. And now I got a free low kick. Crunch. I can't remember what this is. Nah, I'll keep it. Oh, right, it's this thing. Continue stomping. Can at least weaken him a bit. I probably should have, like, trained an electric type or something. But no, the one electric type I have is ground-based. Or, wait, no, there's an electric mouse. Let's see what this thing is like. Iron defense, dragon claw, metal sound, slam. I don't know how that procced, but whatever. I'm not sure how this is procking continuously. I'm 
kind of liking it though. Dragon Steel here, do your worst. Um, metal cl sound, what does it do? Okay, special defense, that doesn't really matter to me. It's just getting faster and faster. Alright, two stages up on defense. This is a very decent Pokemon, especially considering I just got out of I just got out of the slots. I mean, if it had Sword Dance instead of uh, Metal Sound, that'd be really nice. This is, but oh, it's a coconut. Well, you know what? I got a dragon. No, super effective critical hits. What lame! It nearly one hit shot me. You're asking for it now. Hopefully, I have a speed advantage so that I can set you on fire. No! Such lame. Alright, time for my other dragon. Yes, I did just get two dragons from a slot machine. And because of that, I have beaten your gym. I think I spent like three hours there. Whatever, water move. Okay, I guess that's not going to give me anything interesting like, oh, now Pokemon of level 50 are going to obey you. That was the best part about the Celadon badge. Level 30 Pokemon. Granted, at that point, I had already... I usually have, uh... Much higher level Pokemon somehow. Because it's not, like, streaming or anything, so I don't try and do anything interesting. All right, I got the badge, so what do I do now? Who are you? Okay. I still can't steal your boat. How lame. What is this? Uh, the apartment store. Still haven't gone in there. What is this? Have I even gone into this area? Who are you? Ah oh, man, small children attempting news lock for the first time, always funny. Revivify myself. Or wait, I don't know, whatever. Let's see, map. Where me be? Nothing? Okay, so... Tandor Sheets. Okay, so Beach Ball City. 
I guess that's the nuclear reactor, and this is the other nuclear reactor. So go south and then take a left to try and get to the church. I guess I might as well go into the mart. Who are you? <laughs> that was actually very clever. No, I'll figure it out myself. Ah, oh, jeez, it's an elevator. It's gonna take forever. Give me some friggin' stairs. <laughs> oh, wow. What is that? Book ball, off ball, dive ball. Dusk ball, quick ball. Heel ball, net ball, tyro ball, luxury ball, mirror ball. Eh, I think the net ball might be the only good one here. Do, 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 do. 100, 200, so it doubles. That's actually much better than a regular repel. 250, that's one quarter. Mm. Yeah, the super repel is the best one. Oh, I've already got plenty. Holy crap, those things are expensive. Just get a few of these, and come on, let me out. Okay, TM shop. TM and evolution stones. What you got? Thunderstone, hardstone, everstone. Okay. And see what your selection is like. Blizzard, hyper beam, light screen, protect, safeguard, solar beam, thunder, reflect, fire blast, focus blast, pulse swipe. I do want it, but not yet. Giga Impact, Flash... Nah. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna want False Swipe eventually. For catching Pokemon. At which point I'll just, you know, like, level up something to 100 and teach it False Swipe and then only use it to catch Rattata. Alright. Is there a building to the left and wait? Ah, I get it. Programmer needed to put more blank space between the buildings. Between the building floors. Because right now it's kind of like a train, side to side, breaking the illusion of it being an elevator. Yeah. 
I don't know what an Electrolux is. Magnet, Ice Ward, Leftovers. Uh, leftovers are worth it, but I don't ever use held items, really. Especially not consumable ones. Just put on a passive thing and hope that it actually applies. Okay, that's not out. How do I get out of here? Can't even use an escape route because I'm in a town and it'll just take me to the middle. Ah, here it is. Nope, this is not it. Who are you? No one important. Got it. Need surf. Oh no, it's a cutscene. Oh, it's so bright in this cutscene. Almost like they expect you to play the game during the day instead of the middle of the night. Kind of kills the mood. I will set your coconuts on fire. No! Why? Super effective. I still haven't figured out a way to deal with these guys efficiently. As is evidenced by the boss fight I just had with it. I guess super effective absorb is actually fairly decent. Especially with stab bonus. Yes, yes, same type attack Pokemon. Capture style? Oh no, radioactive Pokemon. No, I don't have Mankey. Come on, sheep, it's time to low kick. Smash directly in the face. Switch this guy so that I can fire right off the bat in case it's a coconut. 
I did accidentally battle them while uh, trying to train. It was a double battle. Come on. Aw, no OHKO. At least it used a grass type instead of a water type. Scratch. Weakest move. Alright, and there's the fairy. Ah! What are these things? Oh, right. They're those things. This can't possibly go wrong. Alright, they're rock and water type, so swap out. Craft torch for. Hmm, what's good against rock? Water. What's good against water? Not water. Um. Dragon. You know what's good against both of those? Grass. I guess nuclear's uh... Oh crap. Oh good, it's only single target. Yeah. Dragon, dragon. Dragon, super effective. Fighting, super effective. That's not Arceus at all. Oh, hey, it's a Gyarados. Well, that was pathetic. I'm going to catch this nuclear Gyarados. I am not going to catch it with this guy, though. Let's see. Eesh. Let's see if you can poison it before it kills you. Guess not. Alright. Dragon Steel. Try not to destroy it utterly in one attack. I do want to catch it. Ah! Destroyed utterly in one attack. Pretty sure I already explored this area.
Don't even want to deal with the snail. Okay. Oop. The ferry has left the harbor. Alright, where's my room? That's not it. Also not it. Aha! Dun 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 dun. So much easier than having to deal with a Nurse Joyce feel the entire day or whatever. Mailbox? Oh. Well, I was going to walk past you, but then you walked in front of me. Oh look, it's an upgraded burb. Alright, what's strong against flying? Dragon. Dragon isn't actually strong against flying, I don't think, but... Dragon Steel? That is an amazing typing, defensively at least. Well, steel is just amazing defensively, so... And then you have a dragon. That gets faster and faster every single round. Oh no, a flying type move. Obviously not fast enough. Must get faster. What are you, Equius? Okay, this thing's weak against fighting type moves, so time for a sheep. Or was it weak against dark type moves? I can't remember. Weak against ground type moves? I definitely cannot remember. Okay, wasn't fighting. So it was probably ground. Yep, ground. I am very much liking beat up. Quite strong. But Lombre can probably finish it off. What's fast? I don't think any of them have uh Oh, that is a priority move. Nice. I don't know what this is. Nope. This isn't competitive. 
Dang it. You had one job. Deal with others of your kind. And that is dark types. I mean, that thing had Luna in the name. Sheesh. So lame. Is it dragon or steel that we against dark? I thought steel is only weak against fire. I forgot that this dragon had a fighting type move. I shouldn't have, but I did. Yep, Equius. Okay, so Equus and Nepeta there. Very nice. Oop. Each of these rooms probably has a theme, and I'm not going to get any of them. Modril. Are you weak against grass? Yes, you are. But you are also probably needing to be weak against levels. Yeesh. Didn't even catch the name of that move. Don't hit four times, don't hit four times. And don't hit five times, don't hit five times. Alright, waste your turn, waste your turn. No! That wasn't wasting at all. But, it allow me to do that. is weak against fire, I believe. Mostly weak against fighting, but still. A reason to use my starter for once. Ah, sheesh. How did I forget that it has high defense? Been using this thing for how long? Ah, jeez. Should've just thrown out the dragon. Wow, that is... How many moves that were defensive? Roll out. Okay. Didn't use defense scroll. So roll out didn't suddenly do massive damage. Force palm. Crunch. Ugh. Go ahead and polish yourself, I guess. Doesn't really matter when I bite you. 
and do 1 HP of damage. Pine for the Fjords. I know that's a reference to something. Swap you out to a poison type immediately. Ow. Whoop, nope. Why do I keep doing that? Sheesh. Wow, that's pretty terrible. Well, the answer to this is, as always, dragon. Oh right, also poison. You survive one more turn. Because of that lowering my attack thing. Oh no! Paralyzed! It does not matter how fast I go if I do not move at all. It's fortunate that taking a nap will remove no, all status conditions. Because this is a fairly annoying one. I'm gonna have to check the stats on this guy. Swap in a different dragon. Ah! I believe it's called Basic Human Empathy. Oh good, a thing. Summary of this thing. Brave nature, which means probably strength. Alright, definitely sweeper stats there. Massive attack. Heals its own status problems. Leer. Flinches occasionally. Power 80. Power 60 and Paralyze. Very nice. Sharp increase of defense. 
harsh decrease of special defense. Slam, 80 damage, but fairly terrible accuracy. And of course, Dragon Claw. High defense, high attack. Quirky nature. Don't know what that one is. Off the top of my head. But this seems like a good place to stop. 